This video is going to show uh, developing black and white film. The chemicals I have mixed are ultrafine U60. This is a concentrated developer uh, mixed to a working solution as directed. Also using ultrafine fixer. Ultrafine stop bath. So I have everything mixed to working solutions, developer, stop bath, fixer. I also have water that is temperature regulated at 68 degrees so that I know my water temperature is at 68 consistently. The thing you need to know about development is that depending on the water temperature, the film, and the chemicals you're using, development times will change. Everything I have here is set for 68 degree water and a working solution of the developer I just showed. I have a cheat sheet here. It gives me some additional directions. Uh, step one for me is going to be getting the timer set. And so I have a seven and a half minute development, 30 second stop bath, five minute fixer. And so I just want to go to a time that's beyond that total. Okay, so beyond 13 minutes. I'll go to 15. And then for me to start this, I'm just going to click start. The time is going to start to click down. Take my film. I've already rolled it into the tank. That's another video. You didn't see that. When I put in the developer, I'm going to tilt it slightly. I'm going to go ahead and just open this up, pour in my developer. I want to fill this tank. It takes eight ounces to fill it. So I'll continue to fill until that reaches the top. At which point I'm going to put my lid on, start my timer, and I'm going to start my first 30 second agitation. I also want to kind of wrap the tank a little bit get the bubbles off the film. And now I'm agitating on 30, 25, 5 schedule. I have another video just talking about agitation. So my first 30 seconds for agitation. Then I'm going to set it down in the water to rest for 25 seconds. The water here is cooled up a little bit, 68 degrees keeps everything uh, stable throughout the process. I'm going to agitate between 5 and 0. Okay, I just finished the agitation coming into the seven minute mark. And so I've done seven, and once I get to 30, I'm gonna be at seven and a half. And so I'm gonna start dumping my fluid. The developer goes down the drain, and then I'm gonna to go to a stop right away for 30 seconds. Go ahead and dump this. Right to my stop. Again, I'm kind of tilting it as I pour to make sure that it fills all the way up. When it goes on, 30 seconds of agitation. So let's say I start at 10, I'm going to go to 40. What this does is it neutralizes the development process. So then I can move on to the fixing portion. I'm 
coming into about five seconds beforehand. When I open this up, I start to go. Stop app goes right back into the same bottle. I can use it multiple times until it indicates that it's no longer good. Set that aside. Now I'm going to go to my film fixer, fill this up, begin to tilt it. Once I'm full, I'll put my cap on, give it a couple wraps like that, and then I'm going to go back into my agitation. I'm just going to go ahead and say I started at the six minute mark. I'm doing this for five minutes total. Agitation schedule, 30, 25, 5. Okay, I'm 30 seconds away from my five minute mark on Fixer. Uh, Fixer has a pretty long lifespan. We can use it over and over again. So once it's uh, used, it goes into this used Fixer bottle. About five seconds before, I'm gonna dump this. There's a test to make sure this is still good fixer before it goes back into the uh, primary tank. Once the fixer is out, I'm going to go ahead and just take plain water, 68 degrees. I'm going to fill this up. I'm going to agitate for a little while. I'm not even putting the lid on. I'm going to dump it. Do this three times. Just starting the rinsing process. Help it. After three times, I can open this up. Film. I can't <clears throat> tell yet if it's correct or not. I'm going to rinse it. I just have 35 or sorry, 68 degree water coming up through this piece of PVC pipe. I'm going to leave that for 10 minutes. Rinse all this out. Put it away. Talk to you in 10 minutes. Okay, film's been washing now for 10 minutes. If it needs to go a little longer than that, it's not a big deal. I just reach in, grab this. I can go ahead at this point and unspool it off my reel. This bath right here is called Photo Flow. It's basically a soap that will loosen uh, the surface tension of the water and help it sheet off the film. Sorry, that was a bell in school. So I'm gonna just run this through just like this. Shake it off. And then I can place it in the dryer. Okay, if I'm going into the dryer cabinet, I'm just going to open the door up here, clip my film up on the top. On the bottom, I'm going to go ahead and attach another clip, just like this, so that it holds it tight. Shut the door, turn the dryer on, 20 minutes or so, and it will be dry and ready to remove. 